Hey, what's going on guys? Welcome to Facebook Ads Friday week 33. If this is your first week tuning in, the way this works is every single week on a Friday, I will show you two tried and tested proven profitable products. I will then go on to show you the ad creative that is being used to advertise these products. I will show you the Shopify store selling these products and I will also show you where you can source and buy these products from as well. Let's jump straight into product number one then and I'm excited to show you this one because it's a bit different to the usual products I show you. This particular business I believe are actually manufacturing this product themselves. However, it is a product you can source and still drop ship. I wanted to show you this product because in its own right it's very successful it's a very unique product and it's also a high margin product as well there's a bit of a premise when it comes to drop shipping most people just assume straight away that drop shipping equals aliexpress or drop shipping equals cheap chinese products so this is why i wanted to show this product because the profit margins are awesome so this is the product i discovered using minia or minia however you want to call it it's a brilliant tool i've done a specific video purely on this tool 10 to 15 minutes long demonstrating how to use it and the reason i want to show you some of the stats many are given to me for this is because number one we can see the engagements are increasing as time goes on so that shows it's still an active product all of the products i show you in this series will always be current and active we can see four and a half thousand likes two and a half thousand comments and three and a half thousand shares it goes without saying this has a significant amount of success what it also shows you is the type of audience that's engaging with this and where they're coming from as well. So essentially what we have on our hands here is a proven tried and tested product that we know is profitable. We know exactly what age range is to target. We know exactly what audience, what genders to target. And we know exactly where this product is currently selling. We can see in the United States and Canada is where it is most popular. So if you are watching this in Sweden, if you're watching this in the UK, if you're watching this in Australia, the fact that this product sells really, really well in the United States and Canada probably indicates that it will sell really well elsewhere too. With that being said then, what product is it that I'm actually talking about? So let's put this ad back in and we'll have a little bit of music as well. And let's just play this through so you can see exactly what it is. It's pretty self-explanatory. In the first few seconds, you can see exactly what it is. It's a ramp made for your dog so your dog can easily get up into bed or up onto the sofa and um, just spend time with you, whatever it may be, whatever reason you might want your dog um, to be able to access higher ground. As we can see, a really well put together ad. This is a, I always say real business. Every business that is active is a real business, but this is a proper business. This is a professional business. This is obviously not supplier content. This is content they've probably filmed themselves or paid a lot of money to be filmed. It will be original and unique to the brand um, to really set themselves apart from any kind of pop-up drop shipping store. So we've seen the amount of reactions, 23,000, 6,000 comments and 10,000 shares. Uh, just to show you the newest comments, so 13 hours, 60, now it's 22 one day one day one day two days two days so on and so forth straight away we can see in the last couple of days my two little Bijons love it I was worried about them jumping off the bed the older one is 13 and still spunky now I love the ramp and don't have to worry so we can see straight away within the last couple of days there's somebody who's bought one of these things um, let's go to most relevant um, I'm just going to open this up. Ordered a few days ago, looking forward to seeing it. So what we're looking for, we're looking for that evidence that people are buying this to make sure that when we commit ourselves and build a business around a product like this, we want to make sure that we're going into a market or selling a product that people are actually going to be buying. Just ordered ours yesterday, ordered a few days ago. Uh, do we have one for larger dogs? I love mine worth every penny. We love our ramp. I just purchased the couch ramp so we can see I just purchased the bed ramp for three of my Dashans. We can see there's no doubt about it. People are 100% buying this product. If we actually jump onto the Shopify store um, and what I want to show you is the small bed ramp. And what you actually might be surprised to see if you look at the price down here, $325. 
product. It's not a cheap product, so there's definitely some great profit margins to be had. I'm not going to spend too much time on the Shopify stores because most people aren't interested in that sort of thing. They're called doggoramps.com if you want to spend a bit more time yourself and looking through the sorts of things they're doing. So I'll just point out a couple of my favorite points. So obviously they've got a focus free shipping to USA and Canada. Um, everything here again is custom. It's They've taken the time, they've invested the time, they've got designers on board or done it themselves. They have proper professional photography. Everything on here has been created by themselves. And this is, the word I was going to say is essential to your success. It's not essential. However, it will give you a better chance of being successful if you've got original content plastered over your store rather than just recycling what's already out there. So where the hell are we going to source one of these things? Funnily enough, you can actually get them from AliExpress. However, given the size of the thing, I'm not going to recommend that. Um, I'm just going to kind of take you through Google Shopping. Um, all I've done is a simple search for dog ramp and just point out a couple of the different suppliers and people who are selling these things and just give you kind of my take on what I would do if it was me. So number one, as you can see, there's some on B&Q, Living Social, whoever they are, Amazon.co.uk. However, they're not the same style. They won't be the same quality either if they're selling it for $300. This one's kind of similar. That's on eBay. When it comes to dropshipping, dropshipping is a business model. It doesn't mean AliExpress. It's just a, a means to how you source your products. So you can source your products from suppliers on eBay who already have stock in the UK. So you can order so you can offer that faster delivery. You can source it from AliExpress, as we can see here. You can get similar ones from Amazon too. So you could even order a couple of samples of these things to test them out, check the quality, see if you think you could sell this one. So for example, £37.19, you could probably get away with selling that for 60, 70 pounds, given the fact those guys were selling theirs for 300. So going back to the point I was making, you could order a couple of samples, check the quality, and if they're no good, you send them back, because obviously when you order anything online, you have that protection for a couple of weeks. So it really does give you the freedom to really kind of hone down who you're gonna use as a supplier. And then once you've kind of validated and you're sure that the product is working for you, you can take the leap or you can take the next step in progression that these guys have and either start manufacturing themselves or sourcing a supplier that can manufacture them for you. Um, I wanted to show you it to kind of change your perception or at least to try and get you thinking outside of the box. Don't always immediately go to AliExpress. Yes, it is the easier thing to do, but sometimes if you want to be successful at things, you have to do things that bit better or that bit different to the next person. And this is your answer to that, or this is at least an example of how to do that. So that's product number one. If you're still with me, thank you very much. I hope you guys are enjoying the video. Before we move on to product number two, a very quick message. If you are still yet to start your business, then you have to check out my free training. It's 100% free, it won't cost you any money whatsoever. All I ask is your email address so I can send you a copy of my 194 profitable product ideas. The training itself is about an hour long, but trust me, it will be worth the watch because it literally leaves no stone unturned. It will take you through my four-step formula for building and launching a business in 21 days and getting your first customers in less than three weeks from now. So if that sounds of interest to you, make sure you check that out. So the first link in the description down below. Going back to the traditional dropshipping ways then, moving on to the second product. So this is an undercounter magnetic motion light and this post creation was july 25th of 22 first seen on october 8th and last seen on june 8th which is the date i record this video so it's been active all of that time which goes to show it goes to show that it must of course be making these guys money Twenty-two thousand likes a thousand love hearts five thousand shares and three thousand comments consistent growth across the since August, which shows it's been active for all of that time. And again, as we come down into the demographics, we can see exactly what age groups are interested in this product and we can see exactly what countries too. So the big three here, Australia, UK, United States, if you're watching this video in somewhere in Europe, in Germany, in France, if something is selling really well here, the chances are it will sell really well in your country here, in your country here, in your country, wherever you may be. If we've got a demand for a product in the UK or the US or Australia, they're probably the same demand in Europe or other countries across the world. Let's take a look at their ad 
then let's go all the way back to the beginning and play this um, this looks like cheap supplier content um, making this an ideal product for somebody who just wants to kind of dip their toes in the water test the waters and see how things go if you're new to this because you won't have to invest a lot of time or money to get up and running um, with this particular product we can see it's only a 15 second ad I would guess this is taken from a supplier so you could even use this exact ad and this exact copy if you wanted to but obviously just be aware of the risks that that carries move down into the comments section then what we're looking for again um, let's check out the newest first we want to make sure this is still relevant so one day one day one day three days three days three days five days six days uh, we have five weeks so that's because it will have a reply on if we scroll past through all of the ones with replies and one week one week one week so as you can see um, still a relevant product if we come back up to the top then and have a look at the most relevant comments and see if we can find some people who have bought this thing so we've got Diana here these are so great I love mine got one of these to fit under the cupboard and over my drinks shelf works a treat I got mine at Amazon so these guys are not doing a very good job of filtering out comments like that if I could buy them with PayPal I'd love to have someone so they're missing out on not offering PayPal, that's a really important point. I ordered a few months ago, I love mine, may order a smaller one. Love them, but don't seem to hold a charge. Um, I ordered them, I love mine, I got these all over the house. As we can see, lots and lots of people who have actually purchased this product. If we jump onto the Shopify store then, they don't do a great job of coming across as a very professional seller or kind of branding and owning the products. They just, it is a general store given the inclination of the store name with use and deals and um, what we can see is just how bloody cheap they're selling this for so 9.99 14.99 and 20 dollars however what i am guessing is that most people are going to be buying at least two of these if not three four or even five maybe even half a dozen of these things if i was going to build a store myself to sell products like this i would definitely 100 percent have bundle offers for that reason so somebody who wants to say buy six of these things they don't want to spend 120 dollars so incentivize them by offering at packs of three or packs of six or whatever it may be let's jump on to aliexpress then this to be honest with you guys was one of the first supplies they found for this product um, it's not an identical like for like but they're all pretty similar they all do the same thing and they're all similar prices as well so you've got the two different color options cold and warm so cold's like a brilliant white and warm's like a yellowy color um, and then lots and lots of different sizes as you can see with lots and lots of different amount of bulbs in and you're talking anywhere from sort of three and a half dollars that includes free shipping all the way up to 580 depending on the size you're going for so even though they're selling them for twenty dollars they're only paying five for them fifteen dollars room for one somebody buys three for half a dozen of these things and um, all of a sudden it becomes quite a profitable product and so with that being said that is a wrap on facebook as friday for this week hope you guys have stuck with me if you have please make sure you subscribe to the channel so you can tune in next friday where i show you another two products i do a lot of videos every monday wednesday and friday any comments questions video suggestions anything i can help you with within your dropshipping business drop them down below i read every single one so i will get back to you. Thanks for watching guys and I'll see you in the next one. Cheers.